All right, here we go. You ready? Yeah, you do. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, parallel track. Okay, so I got a bunch of videos. Are you ready? I can't wait. This is, if you guys haven't tuned in yet for Real Take Live, Paranormal Trash is my favorite segment. Well, so what we do is we find viral videos on the internet that are kind of like, you know, they're fun, but they're definitely not anything real. All right, the first one is, I'm going to make you guess. I have a guess. What do you think is going okay. on here? So this mass in the middle that is creeping up the left side is apparently a, uh, a spooky apparition. It's now, kind of the door? Yeah, a little black smudge. You see it? I'm going to restart the video. Alright, so it creeps up bottom left. And it's moving on bottom up by left. the table. It's by the uh, table now. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what's going okay. on there? Tell me. I don't know. What do you got? I think it's like a gnat or an insect walking on the screen. Okay, so... Because of how it moves. And I think it's so close to the lens, it creates this effect. Look at it move. Definitely a bug. But do you see how it goes through the floor, through by the tables, and then almost goes through the window? No, no, it's always it in front, dude. It's on the lens. It's on the lens. No, but keep watching. No, keep watching. It looks like it's on the other side of the window now. Uh, who's it? They want to know what your name is. It's Bregs. It's actually Chris. But that's fine. Someone just said bug. Yeah. I mean, I'm getting a lot of bugs on the camera on Facebook chat, too. I think it just looks like a bug. It's walking. I, you know? I don't fucking know. I mean, but he, I, I'm going to go with bug, too, most likely. But it, it it's interesting to me that it starts out on the inside of the, the uh, diner or whatever this is. And... Yeah, it goes off. It, it goes off of the lens, dude. It walks away. It looks like it's on the other side of the window. No, bro, it's always in front. You could see it like on the, on the window sill. You know, it's right, always. So we're going with. Bugs. Listen, I don't want to bully you into an answer here. <laughs> no, everybody, everybody else in Facebook chat the same bug. I'll yeah, bug. Uh, friggin' bug, everybody. All right, here we go. Here we All right, go. This Next is scary. This is scary. Oh, oh! This. look at this oh i'm doing jumping jacks oh my god that thing is terrifying though so they go to run and see yeah, but how does she know it was there she didn't turn around no the other girl's videotaping dude what do you think there's just a all right so she freaks out the girl who's videotaping freaks out they run up and then it's boom at the top of the stairs <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's definitely creepy, and then they go outside, and you can see it in the window, and it, like, teleports down to the second-story floor. I mean, listen, I give these girls credit. What are they, in, like, seventh grade? Yeah, they she... can pull this off? Oh, totally creepy. That thing is terrifying. I mean, they did a good job. They did a good job. Let's get a round of applause for, for these, uh, filmmakers here. Great job. First round of applause on Real or Fake. Congratulations, girls. All yeah, right. Not, not bad for seventh grade. I agree. So in this one, this tape, this TV is rocking back and forth. This guy's like, yo, I don't got wires. No wires here. <laughs> and then he <laughs> and then he dips down. The camera's like blacking out because of the paranormal experiences. And then this starts rocking out of control. No, he, he said there was no like device underneath and then this this happens within his same home i think this guy was like an engineer and he figured out what's up here how to make that tv rock the freezer is probably relatively easy you know like they stop the camera they stop moving and then he obviously the tv's 
But the TV's easy. He's showing the, the bottom of the TV with nothing else. You could just put your hand over it and move the thing. That is absolutely what happened. See what I'm saying? I think this is like the the home run of Paranormal Trash right here. <laughs> Oh, that's such a bold thing to say. I mean, listen, we're getting a lot of fakes here. We're getting the, a lot of the fakes here. Of the TV. I can do that too. I can show the bottom of the TV and, and move it with my hand. Yeah, you you sure could. So, is this making you yeah. upset now? Are you mad at this? This video? No, I just, it just I just feel like we could we could do better. You know, oh, I just got a great idea. I'm not going to tell anybody yet. But great, great, great idea. thanks for sharing that with everybody. All right, you want to do the last paranormal? <laughs> <laughs> Someone wrote, So dumb, you're kind of you're right, you're right. You know, I give this effort technically, I don't know, a C minus, a zero. I think the girls had the A, you know, they put on a real show. Listen, they, for, for yeah. They actually tried. Um, all right, here we go. Last one. You ready? This one legitimately like scared the shit out of me when I. It's just a scary. You ready? Yep. So these guys, they're like trying to make a mock ghost hunter parody in this video, okay. but then they capture this in the mirror. And it's a fucking face. How scary is that? <laughs> Look at this thing. <laughs> that is terrifying. Hold on, I didn't get up to it. Oh, man. You I don't see it. Are you serious? You guys see it, right? <laughs> yeah, dude, it's clear as day. <laughs> they, they zoom in on it. They zoom in on it. How How do you not see it? It's going slow mo. There he is, terrifying. It's just really someone said matrix mate oh I can't talk. Matrixing. Dude, I don't I don't see a face. That's insane. That you don't I guess your computer isn't picking it up. Um But uh it really looks like a face. It's so creepy. Hold on, I'm watching it on the Facebook feed now. Go ahead. You know, what do you guys think? While Bregs... No, I still don't see a face. Dude, it's in I, the glass, I... man. Bottom right of the glass. And then they box it off in the all video. Right. All right, I kind of... All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I kind of see it, but no. I think that's just made your mind playing tricks on you. 100%. I see it clear as day, though. I see it now. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, I see the nose. Okay. I, I, I see the wait, eyes. See, it really looks yes, like a man. It's really creepy. Tommy said smudges on the glass. It looks. Uh, somebody said it looks like a face in a jar. It. Dude, it definitely looks like a face. <sighs> yeah, but I wouldn't go. Like, it took me forever to actually realize that. Dude, I saw it immediately. Which is crazy. Really? Yeah. Oh, uh, oh, okay. What are you? You're getting now deeper I, in it. I, well, that's the thing, though, and that's where your mind fucks with you because you kept saying that. So the first three times I watched it, I didn't see a face. Right. But now you kept saying in the bottom corner of the uh, the thing, don't you see the eyes? Don't you see the nose? Now watching it over and over again, your mind starts to tell you that there's a face there. Yeah, right. 100%. I, I, it scared the shit out of me. I was like, oh, my God. But now, now it, to me, looks creepy as shit. Because I know, I dude, because now you see it. But it took me forever to actually realize that. I know. It, dude, it's so creepy. But there you go. Lesson learned. Lesson learned. Lesson learned. All right, we have five more minutes. Yeah, we do. We did a good job tonight. <laughs> oh, yeah? 
Uh, well, we, we started yeah, the show right. on time. Well, the past two weeks, if you guys haven't tuned in, we started the show 15 to 20 minutes late because we've had some issues. Uh, and I wanted to make sure that we were on time tonight. So we started early. We got all our shit together. Uh, yeah. But we did, I feel like we did a great job. Listen, um, we want you guys, if you're tuning in for the first time and we say this every week, we want you guys to send us your evidence and your videos if you can. Um, we would love to use it for real or fake. Uh, so send it to us. We'll talk to you. Uh, obviously, you know what we do with the videos. Um, so send it to us, paranormalwarehouse at gmail.com. And we will talk to you about it, and we would love to get it on the next episode of Real or Fake or one of the episodes of Real or Fake Live. Uh, we are on every Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern right here. Um, you can watch it on Viddy Space Live, Periscope on Viddy Space or Paranormal Warehouse Facebook. As always, every week. Um, Everyone's being so kind yeah. on Periscope. Hey, thank you guys for listening in. Uh... Yo, I also want to give a shout out again to the crew at the Ghost Hunter Dan Norvell Project. Um, you can find them at Ghost Hunter, one word, Ghost Hunter Dan Norvell Project on YouTube. And they're starting up their Expedition Entity series. So, yo, everyone over there, thanks for submitting. It was fun to, I feel like it puts more on us to actually think about it. Because I don't want to be a piece of shit, you know what I mean? <laughs> It's like a real yeah, well, to a real listen, person. We never want to put, yeah, we and also we never want to put anybody shit down. We're gonna tell you what we think honestly about it, but at the same time, I think that's what um, deciphering these uh, evidence videos is about: is getting other people's opinion and talking about them and and debunking stuff. If maybe that person didn't think of something, what would have caused that? Maybe we thought of something, or somebody in the Facebook chat might have thought of something, or whatever else. I just think it's more beneficial to get more people involved in uh, looking at evidence. So whether we made fun of it or not, I think overall it's a good thing for the paranormal community. So, Yeah, Yo, you're so deep, bro. I'm trying. Well, listen. I'm trying to get everybody involved. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give your internet like an A minus because it really tried. It really tried this show. Never shut down. Uh, never shut down. And uh, it was in bad shape. Uh, I did great last week, but yeah, I don't know. But uh, you know, good job. All right, listen. I guess we could wrap up and be done. I'm gonna cook a steak and eat it. And my dog tried to eat it and took it off of the cutting board and ran over to her bed. And my wife rescued the steak. And I'm going to wash so it off. Have... I'm going to wash it off, even though my dog's mouth was on it. And I'm going to throw it in a hot pan. And then I'm going to stick it in the oven for four minutes after it's seared. And I'm going to eat it. And I'm going to love it. Done. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Well, thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Make sure you check us out, paranormalwarehouse.com. Uh, we have live static cams going all the time uh, from haunted locations. And then uh, check out our Instagram and Facebook and everything else. And if you have evidence you want us to use on Real Fake, hit us up. We'll use it. We'll thank use it. Yo, out. also, 10 p.m. Eastern time tomorrow on Viddy Space, Ghost Box Chronicles. Definitely check that out. Check uh, it out. Moon and D. Our buddies are going to be over there. Um, so definitely check that out tomorrow. All right, bye. All right, have a good night, everybody. All right, have a good night, everybody. <laughs>